Today on the show, there's breaking news from Arakeen. Is TikTok ruining your children's water discipline? Find out tonight on Arakeen Action News 13 at 5.47 p.m. <laughs> Weirdly specific time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Gam Jabbar, your guide to the iconic world of Dune. We'll be exploring the themes, philosophies, and characters found in the sandy depths of this vast universe, from Frank Herbert's groundbreaking novels to the adaptations on film and TV. Mm. My name's Abu. My name is Leo. <laughs> and today we're doing none of those things. <laughs> today is all about <laughs> us. It's us day. <laughs> Woo! You got to celebrate yourself sometimes. That's what we're doing today. Treat yourself, people. Come on. Exactly. Yeah. No, but in all reality, we actually have some really exciting updates and news to share with our listeners today. Yeah. And we wanted to take a minute to go through some of the details about all of the exciting things to look forward to for our listeners. Yeah. And our excitement spans from little things like, oh, I don't know our whole patron structure to, you know, <laughs> really big things like hot new merchandise. Yeah. But we'll get into it. I don't want to get ahead of myself. Mm -hmm. Probably the most exciting thing for you, dear listener, is going to be news regarding our Children of Dune book club series. Yes. And when we're going to begin that incredible journey. <sighs> I can't wait. Yes, exactly. We're going to go over all of that in today's little mini update episode. Of course, if you have any thoughts or questions, or you just want to say hello and send us memes, shoot us an email at gomjabarpodcast at gmail.com, the best place to get in touch. Indeed. Well, let's get into it. Let's talk about today's announcement. Save the date, folks. Uh-huh. <laughs> Imagine this is a postcard. Magnet it to your <laughs> fridge. Look at it every day as you go for your morning sip of orange juice. I don't know. May 20th. May 20th. <laughs> May 20th. We are going to be doing a lot of things. But first up, we're going to be launching our first episode of the Children of Dune Book Club series. Yes, that is right. What a good day. <laughs> what a great day. So as usual, we'll be diving into that book roughly 50 pages at a time. Mm -hmm breaking down each chapter and exploring the dance lore of the story. Right. Just like we did for book one and for book two. And speaking of books one and two, if you haven't read the first two books and you haven't listened to our 10-part Dune series or the eight-part Messiah series, make sure that you've done that. Read both of those books, listen to both of those series before you dive into Children of Dune with us. Absolutely. Now, as always, our Children of Dune book club series will be spoiler-free. We are only going to be talking about the things that have happened up until that exact page, doing our best to protect this as an experience if this is your first time making your way through the book. We've gotten so much feedback that, thank God, by the way, Abu, that this works for people. We've gotten word from people that this has made their first read through of the books even better. Mm -hmm. So join us. I wasn't sure if it would, but apparently it has. <laughs> Nevertheless, we also go very deep into the Dune Encyclopedia, as well as Frank's kind of ongoing themes and maybe recurring ideas that might be easy to forget about on a first read. Yeah. So this series will also offer plenty for longtime fans and people returning to the book after a time away. That's right. Now, we're going to post the full Children of Dune book club schedule in the show notes, mm -hmm. and it'll also be available on social media. So make sure you follow our network at lore underscore party on Twitter for the most up-to-date news right. coming to you live on our Akeen Action News 13 <laughs> at 547 5 p.m. Is that Eastern? Is that Mountain Time? They did not specify. <laughs> yeah, in Carthage, you have to remember it's you carry an hour. Yeah, it's... <laughs> And the last thing we want to say about the Children of Dune Book Club, that first episode will be releasing on May 20th on both the free public feed mm -hmm. and the Patreon feed. Right. But a reminder that patrons have access to the book club episodes as soon as they release. Right. Free listeners on the public feed will hear the rest of the Children of Dune series starting in August. 
I mean, what a good reason to become a patron yeah. so that you don't have to wait months and months and months. It's almost like we planned it that way. Mm. But speaking of, speaking of Patreon, let's talk about an update we're going to be making to our tiers and that structure. It's all good. We promise. Basically, we are going to be simplifying our tiers and combining some of the benefits and streamlining a little bit of what you're donating to us and kind of then what you get for it. So let's break down, starting May 20th, what are the three tiers, three levels of support, and what you get with each? Let's talk about it. That's right. So to start with, at the $2 per month off-worlder tier, yep. you'll get an invite to our exclusive Discord server where you can chat with me and Leo directly, and you can also hang out with our lovely community. Folks in there are talking Dune. We talk the books we're reading, science fiction, fantasy, other geeky stuff. Sometimes there's MCU talk. It's a really great community. Everyone is lovely, and it's a great place to hang out and meet people who love Dune just as much as you. Yeah. At the $5 a month member of the tribe level, you'll get a ton of benefits. This is really the meatiest tier yeah. for people who want a little bit more, right? For sure. People at the $5 a month member of the tribe level get ad-free episodes. Ooh. Hello. We, that's extra editing for us. Book club episodes as soon as they release. No mm -hmm. waiting like a free listener. <laughs> you get to <laughs> vote to help us decide lore topics for upcoming deep dive episodes. We love a democracy. We love a democracy. If we learned anything from Dune. <laughs> Weekly bloopers and bonus clips that don't make the final cut either because they're too, too spicy or they are <laughs> a mess. <laughs> and then occasionally we do live shows where you get to listen in live. You get to see how the sausage is made. You get to see how messy it gets. Yeah, truly. And often, depending on how many people we have, we'll do like question and answers or we'll engage a bit with you during that time. It's a lot of fun. It's cool. Yeah. It's a ton of fun. So those are some of the benefits you get at that member of the tribe $5 level. Now, the third tier that we have is the $100 per month Kwisatz Haderach level. You are the chosen one at this point. Yeah. And if you sign up for this benefit tier, you get all of the perks that the previous levels do. Plus, we will shout you out at the top of every episode for as long as you are a supporter at this level. Indeed. Now, the eagle-eyed among you have spotted the difference. You've spotted what has changed. Mm -hmm. And for clarity, we're getting rid of the $10 Freeman Nabe level. And for our current members who are at that level, you'll be automatically dropped down to the $5 member of the tribe tier. Now, we do not mean <laughs> to say that that $5 difference is unappreciated, and of course, Patreon lets you donate any amount, any custom amount. So if you'd like to continue supporting us at $10 a month, we absolutely appreciate it. It's, it's very, very kind if you decide to. But at the end of the day, you'll get all of the benefits that you're currently experiencing for $5 less a month. Yeah. If you'd like to do Look that. Look at that. Yeah. That's right. And these Patreon updates and these changes will go into effect on May 20th, same day that the Children of Dune book club kicks off. But that's not all that's happening on May 20th, Leo. Oh. There's more. I am so excited for this. <laughs> <laughs> all right. The final piece of today's announcement. Uh-huh. We've got new merchandise on the way. Yes. Uh, she. So... <laughs> <laughs> We, you better line up some more dates. You got more clothes to wear. <laughs> I know. Get on those apps, folks. <laughs> <laughs> we are both very busy. And for a while now, we've both wanted to put more things on the merchandise store from that perspective of what do we want? What are the things that we would want to own? What are the pieces of Dune merchandise that we dream of? Uh -huh. Well, we've paired with a couple of incredibly talented artists We've also gotten our various tablet tools out. We've gotten, we've brushed off our pencil sets. We've bothered my father <laughs> to <laughs> do more work for us. And ultimately, we are going to be bringing on May 20th, 
some brand new original Gom Jabbar exclusive Dune art in the form of merchandise that honestly, even just based on these early sketches, I'm so excited for. It's going to be good. It's going to be so good. Yes, I am so <laughs> excited about this merch. And just to give you a little tease on what to expect, Yeah. currently we're working on cool new stuff like a tote bag, suck it, WNYC, <laughs> a fanny pack for uh-huh. your next hike out into the woods for the weirdos who do that, <laughs> some new wall art, a pint glass for the alcoholics among you, Sheesh. long sleeve shirts and hoodies. And more. Yeah. So all of that oh. is currently in development. We're <laughs> finalizing the merch and the designs. And those things will be available on May 20th on gomjabarshop.com. Brand new merch, folks. Get yeah. excited. Very, very exciting. And I'll also say just honestly, having done some of our merch designs, I've gotten good feedback about them. You know, it's really humbling and wonderful to see people having ordered any of the things that I've designed because <laughs> imposter syndrome is a real thing. I am so excited <laughs> to have other artists represented on this platform. I've always been very passionate about lifting up artists and giving them a platform. Yeah. But also to get some sweet original Dune art out of it. It's really a win win, win win win. And it's all possible because of you all supporting us, which, so thank you. <laughs> That's it. Definitely. Thank you. <laughs> for sure, for sure. And look, we got some early sketches in just a couple of days ago, and I squealed when I opened <laughs> that email. Oh. <laughs> I can't wait for everyone to see yeah. what these artists we've partnered with have worked on. I panicked. So cool. I did a full 190-degree <laughs> swivel, found a coworker who vaguely knows what I do, and I yeah. went, Abby, come here right now. <laughs> Can <laughs> Can I show you this? this? Yeah. <laughs> it's very exciting. So that's what to expect on May 20th. It's a big day here for Gaum Jabbar. The Children of Dune Book Club series will kick off. Some Patreon updates will go into effect. And we'll be dropping brand new merch for all of you to wear on those dates that you're going on every week. Get it? (laughs) Now, just to wrap up this little update, we did want to say truly, to get serious here for a minute, truly a thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Yeah for all of your support, for your messages, for tuning in week in and week out. We love making this show. We've not been doing it for, what, two plus years? Yeah. We love the show. We love creating it. We love the Dune universe. We love the Dune fandom. And it is truly a privilege to be able to do this. There's so much exciting Dune content coming in the next couple of years. And we've said this before and we'll say it again. It's never been a better time to be a Dune fan. So we're honored to be on this journey with you, all of our listeners, this little community we've created together, and we hope you'll be joining us on this golden path every step of the way. I personally cannot wait. Yeah. The other day I I went on Spotify and I scrolled through all of our episodes (laughs) and it's really breathtaking how much, how not only how much work, you know, I think I calculated it the other day. It's something like over 2000 hours (laughs) of labor. In the last two oh, years. Oh, no. But you're right. You were absolutely speaking for both of us. It's so much fun. And to connect with people who care so passionately about this franchise, but also to bring some humor and some light and some joy to people's days, especially in like a very difficult couple of years, it's more than I ever hoped I'd be able to achieve. And it's all because of the support of our listeners that we were able to do this. I don't know that Abu and I would have made it this far if we didn't have as many people listening as we do. So thank you. Yeah. And truly, you know, every every person you force to listen to us or every uh, every time you suggest Gam Jabbar to a friend, you're doing an immeasurable service for us. Yeah. So thank you. Right. Our power level rises. <laughs> <laughs> Little pebbles are floating <laughs> as we scream. <laughs> Well, friends, there is no real ending. It's just the place where you stop the recording. But this podcast is always one step beyond logic, so help spread the word of Mwadib and leave us a review on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. And be sure to check out the other shows on the Lore Party Podcast Network on loreparty.com. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram at lore underscore party. 
Thank you so much for listening. And remember, he who controls the podcast controls the universe. We'll see you on the golden path. Find out tonight on Arcane Action News 13 at 5.47 p.m. Weirdly specific time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why not round that up to like just 6 p.m.? What are we doing here? <laughs> That's such an off-worlder thing to say. Good Lord. Oh, look at me. <laughs> News on Kaladin starts at 6. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> David Muir's not fucking around on Kaladin. <laughs> Is that a news person? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. It's a very famous news person. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know that member of Aerosmith. <laughs> <laughs>